we're gonna rate the ultras. The supers in this game are, are, are lame. They're all gonna get three out of 10, but the ultras are cinematic and crazy. So we're definitely gonna do rate the ultra. Okay, so DiCapre Ultra One. Uh, it's a utility ultra. Uh, I'm gonna give it a three out of 10. Okay, DiCapre Ultra Two. Oh, this one's much better. That's pretty cool. I'm gonna say DiCapre Ultra 2 is probably a eight out of 10. I think it's good. I think it's a good one. All right, Ryu time. Let's go Ryu. This one's gonna be amazing. I got the windscreen off of it, but I don't think that helps out that much. I think Shinko Hadouken is so basic in this game. I think it's like a four. I'm actually not gonna give Shinko a lot because I think it's not that good. However, his other one, here, here's Ryu's Ultra 2. I like Shinsho a lot. I don't love it though. I think it's great, and I like that you can see the character's face, but I still think it's a... I think it's still an eight and a half. I don't quite want to give it a nine, right? I don't want to give it a nine, but I still think it's really good. So I think I'm also going to give that one an eight. All right, Ken. Let's let Honda have it. Ken's is also good. Once again, another character with an eight out of ten super. Ken Ultra 2... Just the, the kick version. Oh, God. Big eyeballs. I think this one's actually cooler, but not enough to, like, raise it a whole point. Once again, it's like, nah, I don't know, actually. Now that I think about it, I'm going to give that one, like, a seven. Honda time. There we go. Ah. Uh, I think it's neat how he carries him across the screen, but that might be about it. Six out of ten. All right, Honda two time. Sayonara, sucker. Mm, I'm gonna give that one a five. I don't know, man. Kind of basic. Here we go. I think that one's actually really cool. I kind of want to give it a nine. It's got a cool moment where she does like one with the palm and then she transitions again. I think it's not bad. I don't think it's a nine though. I don't think we've seen an, uh, I don't think many have reached nine yet. So I think I'm going to give it an, an uh, I'm going to go with eight. Okay, now the kick version. There's the nine. Yeah, that one's a nine out of 10. In my opinion, Ultra 2 is a uh, e even cooler looking, more cinematic. Yeah, that it, it's un almost unfair because a lot of the characters that have Ultras in the later versions of Street Fighter 4, the super characters and beyond have way cooler looking Ultras. Okay, Makoto. God damn! That's badass. Yeah, Makoto's got easily a 9 out of 10. I mean, the KO screen might have helped a bit, so I might be a little biased. But the whole aspect of, like, shoot your ass up, low shot down to their down to their face. She said, go Danzuki! <laughs> like, and you're ah! You're, like, flying up. That's pretty great. Okay, here's Makoto Ultra 2. Great camera work. It's a utility super too, because the whole point of um, Abare's Tosunami, I think is what it is, which is from Third Strike, is about the follow-up. You get a follow-up where you can do crazy shit or reset them or something like that. So I don't think that one's amazing. I think it's a seven, because the previous one just had so much climax and buildup and shit. Uh, Dudley time. Uh, I don't know, man. I think Corkscrew Blow is kind of lame in this game. I don't think it's bad, but I'm going to give it a six. Here's probably the much better super. That one's badass, dude. Just the boof, 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 boof. Um, I think that one's badass. I'm probably going to give Dudley's a an eight out of ten. 
I think that one's fun. And then here we go, the, the goofy characters. Uh oh, I'm gonna get the final screen too. Yeah! Kinda goofy. I think Seth's is a seven. Uh, and here's Ultra 2 on Seth. Weird ass Ultra. Such a weird ass Ultra. I give that one a five. Yeah. Five out of ten. So, uh, Goken Ultra 1, I don't remember being that crazy. Let's find out. Yeah, so the funny thing is, it's like, it's a Shinsho, and Ryu's is like Mezzo Shinsho or whatever the hell, but it's not the best, you know? I don't know, I think that one's like a six. I feel like since it's a season one Ultra that it kind of gets thrown under the rug in comparison. And Ultra 2? I remember to charge it in the very end. And then Denjin is just like neat utility super, but nothing nothing crazy special. I give that one like a four as well because it's like reuse. That's a good demon, right? That is, I think that's a good demon. I think that's a solid eight out of 10 raging demon. Not the best of all time, but still really good. Here we go. It's a weird one. The other realm awaits. It's goofy, but I used to call this super Looney Tunes. I used to, uh, I used to describe this super as being very Looney Tunes. But I think it's cool. I don't like it as much as... I think it's about on the same level as the demon. It's neat, right? I give it an 8 out of 10. But it's kind of weird. It's a little Looney Tunesy. So again, Ultra 1. Jeez, that does so little damage. Oh my god. Oh, it's because we're on double Ultra. Gen's first Ultra, I think, is a 6. Yeah, 6 out of 10 for Gen's first Ultra. Damn, that's pretty badass. The background exploded. <laughs> that's pretty badass. I'll give that one a 7 out of 10. I kind of like it. Hold on a second. Let's look at it in full. That one, I think, is cooler than all the others. Uh, I'd give that shit a... At least an 8 out of 10. At least an 8 out of 10. There we go. Ah, I'd give it a 6 out of 10. Yeah, just about just about a 6 out of 10. Uh, all right, Dan, let's do this. God, it's so Dan. Eight, 8 out of 10. A really good super still. Oh, Dan's second one is kind of lame. Yeah, Dan's second one is kind of lame. I'd give Dan's second one like a 5 out of 10. It's a little bit better than the usual stuff. And Sakura's Ultra 1 is... And she could angle it up and stuff like that. So that's kind of a... That's a 4 out of 10. Solid 4 out of 10. Okay, and her Ultra 2. This is her Vanilla Super. There it is. Yeah, it's okay. It's obvious how, like, not as flashy some of the Vanilla Supers are. I think hers is a... 6 out of 10? Nah, I give it a 7. It's a little bit higher. It's a 7. Oni's Ultra 1, I think, is also kind of not too spectacular. Asses to asses. Butts to butts. Just a fireball. I think it's kind of cool because he does say asses to asses at the beginning. So I'll give him a 5 out of 10 for that. Hang on a second. If you do it, if you do it really tight, you get a different animation. Oh no, this is dope now. Damn. Yeah, that's a solid 8 out of 10. That's a badass super right there. And now, the god super. There we go. Ten out of ten. Eleven out of ten. Ten out of ten. 
Asura's Wrath out of 10. Fantastic super. Absolutely fantastic super. Holy shit. Uh, Poison Ultra 1, let's hope this works. Damn, slap the shit out of that booty. That's a great super. I'd honestly give Poison's Ultra 1 a 9 out of 10. That's a great super. And then her Ultra 2. Oh shit. She kicks you in your dick! Where you're non-existent dick. The no dick kick. Yeah, Poison is vulgar as shit in this game. She's definitely a Final Fight character. That's pretty good. I'm gonna give it a 7 out of 10. Here's the greatest super in the game. A zero out of ten. Brave Dance, though. Brave Dance is pretty sick. I like how fast she moves. Then she poses in the end. Brave Dance is cool. I give Brave Dance an eight out of ten. But that first one ruined the game. First one actually ruined the game. Yeah, I kind of want to give Brave Dance a nine. Yeah, I think I'm going to go back and give Brave Dance a nine. I think it's great. Rolent. Rolentos is alright. It's a 7 out of 10. Roland Super 2. The Wire. Eh, it's neat. I think I also give it a 7 out of 10 as well. Like, I like it. This doesn't really have the, the impact I'm looking for. Now, what about Hakans? Is this, am I doing it right? Oh, I did it right. I remembered. I played enough Hakan. I almost give it an 8 out of 10 just because it's so weird. You almost, like, have to give it an 8 out of 10. Uh, what is your ultra? Probably double double half circles or double full circles? There we go. Just such a weird super, right? He's still got some, some weird, freaky supers. I, I give him an 8 out of 10 because they're creative and odd, but... I still kind of like him. I kind of like him. Cody, give me what you got. Ah, it's a good effort super. I think it's a 7 out of 10, but it lacks the the special pizzazz. And then I think kick, kick dirt is... There we go. Damn. <laughs> gets stuck in the wall, too. I think that one's good. I think that's a, uh, I think Cody's gets a 8 out of 10, right? I think this is, I think this is pretty great. And then Guy. That is one hell of a, dude. That's great. I don't think I'd give it over an 8 yet, but I still think it's really good. Really good. Yeah, it's a very effective Izuna drop, but I don't think I give it over an eight. Okay, here, what's this one like? Yeah, that's a nine out of ten. Nine out of ten. That one is sick. Ninja Raging Demon. Muy buenas. Hella, hella muy buenas. That one was great. All right, Cami time. Hopefully this is one. Jesus, it feels like it's her exact same Ultra from the previous game. Um, I'll give that a 7 out of 10. There we go, counter super. Damn, I think that one's actually really cool. I'd almost want to give that one like a uh, an 8 or a 9 out of 10. I think that's really sick. I'm going to give it an 8. I think it's really cool. It's like almost a reference to the Street Fighter movie. There we go. Damn! Ah, that's okay. Anything special happen in the end? No, not really. I'll give it a... That's like a six. I'm not a huge fan of that one. I want to see the kick one more. There we go. Oh, wow. Sobot Festival isn't even cinematic. It's like a regular-ass super. 
Oh, I didn't even realize. That one's like a five. Yeah, it's really not even that great. That sucks. I thought he had a more cinematic super. Uh, Bison is, I think, just charge back with kicks. There we go. I think Bison has a really great super. I think that's an eight out of 10, especially for being a vanilla super. Oh God. That's badass, dude. I kind of love Bison's Ultra too. I think that's a nine out of 10. I think that one is sick. Now, Sagat's amazing Ultra two. Oh, this is Ultra one. And he's still gonna die, right? Or am I gonna get cinematic? Uh, it's okay. I think that's like a six out of ten. And then now is appropriate ultra two. I believe this is what I gotta do. Yeah, like a lot of the big fireball supers in this game, the only one that's genuinely interesting I feel is Oni. That's like a four, right? Like a four out of ten. Uh, see Viper time. Mm, I'm gonna give it a five out of 10. I don't think it's anything that special. I think five is appropriate. God damn, that's a cool, that's like a, I'd actually give that like a nine out of 10. Personally, I'd give it a nine out of 10. Okay, Abel. All right, spinning. Winning. Jesus! Breathless is, uh, was that, was that Breathless? I think it was. Uh, that's an eight out of 10. Pretty good. It's got a lot of build and setup. I still think that one's about a, a seven. Seven out of 10, not bad. Yeah, that is indeed final justice. Pretty much, Abel's just doing final justice against you. Very true. All right, Chun, uh, I think this is the fireball one. It doesn't even move during it, man. That's like a, I'd almost give Chun's like a three out of 10. I think that one is super lame. However, this one, Pretty, you know, it's got this nice flow to it. I give that one like a seven out of 10. I think that one's, I think that one's not bad. Dalsam, however. It's like strictly utility super. Dalsam's is like, Dalsam's is like no joke, like a two. I kind of love this super, right? I think this one's an eight out of 10. It's a weird, crazy ass super, and I think it's good. I do like it. Uh, Yoon time. Hope you like dicks. Get ready. And you get like a follow up after that. I think that's only okay. I think that's like a six out of 10. Yoon time, again. Jesus Christ, he rides you like a skateboard. He rides you like a skateboard. Nine out of 10. All right, jury. Yep, and Feng Shui, yeah, as I remember, is just a modifier super. So for the sake of it being cin cinematic, it's like a one, you know? For the sake of it being cinematic, it's a one. But she does have a much better super. Boof! Um, pretty great. I think that one's almost a 10 out of 10, right? I think, I think just like the aspect of the carrying the motion, she kicks you up, she flies back down, slides across and catches you with the back of her foot and hangs you over the back of herself with you impaled on her foot? And then she talks shit to you? <laughs> 10 out of 10. Creative as shit super.
Yeah, it's got a lot of character personality in it. Yeah, it's a good super. All right, uh, Guile Ultra One. It's gonna have to be like a three out of 10, man. Like a three out of 10 for me. All right, let's see if I can get this on the first try with this damn controller. Nice. Strike! It's okay. I think that one's like a five, you know? It's all right. But it's about a five out of 10. Evil Ryu. Ultra one? See, I think that's another, I think that's a good example of a super that works kind of effectively. That's just a fireball and it's a little bit better. Like that one's like a five out of 10, you know? Like it's okay. It's not incredible, but at least it's okay. Let's try the charge. Oh shit, yeah, it does have a little bit different of an animation. Yeah, in that situation, I'd probably give that one a six. If you got the full charge timer, it's a little bit different. All right, Evil Ryu, let's do this shit. It's a 10 out of 10. It's a 10 out of 10. Absolutely, it's a 10 out of 10. You already knew it was coming. One of the sickest supers in the whole game. Blanca? Yeah, my God, man. That super is like a two. It's like a two. The two out of 10. There we go. It's like a four. It's like a four out of 10. And that one's also about a four out of ten. <laughs> well, that's it. They're both they're both about four out of ten. Let's try Zangief's. I think that's only an okay atomic buster. I think it's about a seven. It's decent. It's not incredible, but it's decent. There we go. That's a 9 out of 10. That's a 9 out of 10. That one's badass. That's a that's a great fucking super. You feel like you're just flying through space as he's messing with you. The camera work is hilarious. I think that one's a 9 out of 10. I think it's really good. All right, El Fuerte time. El Fuentes. There we go. I still think it's kind of a neat super. Maybe a six or a seven. Yeah, I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say a six. I'm trying to remember if Ultra Spark is an anti-air, but we're gonna find out. No, it's not, it's just fast. That's kind of a cool super. I think that one's about a seven. I think it's a little bit better. And then Rufus. I'm gonna have a five. Five out of 10. Could be because I just hate Rufus. Could have something to do with it. And then Rufus Ultra 2. Three out of 10. That's kind of cool. I give it like a six. It's kind of cool. There we go. Man, it's kind of like the other one, just not nearly as cool. Um, I'd give that one maybe like a five out of 10. And then Balrog has a command grab super that I want to see end. <laughs> the facial animations in this game. That one's not bad. I like that one. I think it's, that's a, uh, I think it's about a seven out of 10. I think you have different ways that you can end that ultra, but it's just like, it is what it is, you know? It is what it is. He's gonna lunge forward into you a bunch of times. I think it's like a solid five out of 10, you know? Five out of 10. Okay, Fei Long got ultra one. Here we go. I think it's all right, you know? Six out of 10, six out of 10.
That's pretty dope. I'd give that one a 7 out of 10, right? I think that's pretty dope. I like it. And then T-Hawks. Oh, God. Can I land this first try? Whoa. Still, I only think it's about... I think it's only about a 7, right? It's a decent command grab with a lot of impact. Still a 7 out of 10. Get him! Not bad. Yeah. I'll give that a, uh... I almost want to give it a 9. I think that one's pretty badass. I think that one's pretty dope. Whack, whack, whack! <laughs> Throw your ass down. I kind of love it. Aton, uh, Ultra 2, maybe? That's pretty cool. Yeah, 7 out of 10. Right? 7 out of 10. Here we go. That's pretty cool looking. Just like the camera work in general, I think is also kind of sick. I think it's a 7 out of 10. And then Rose. Oh, the ShamWow. Wow, is that kind of lame by comparison? Oh, she just like electrocutes the shit out of you with psycho power. I'm gonna give that one like a, a five. And a pure... A pure utility super, but it's like a two, you know? It's like a, it's like a two out of ten. Symptomatically. All right, uh, here we go, Yang Super 1. Nine out of ten. Super sick. Camera's just all over the place. He's dipping, he's flipping, he's whipping, he's whippity, he's dippity. Nine out of ten, that's really badass. Here we go, uh, Ultra 2. God, I love the camera work on that one, so I give that one a 9 out of 10 as well. I think both of Yang's supers are badass. Okay, let's check out- let's check out Hugo's. Damn, that one's good. That's a good super. I give that one an 8 out of 10. I like it a lot. Oh, shit. A lot of great camera work on that one. It kind of lacks impact in the end. I feel like it has more impact in um, Street Fighter Cross Tekken. But still a really good super, you know? 8 out of 10. At least an 8 out of 10 for Hugo. A lot of really cool cinematic stuff going on. Here we are at the end of all things. One of the biggest rosters in Street Fighter history. I think that the some of the best supers in this game belong to, obviously, Oni and Evil Ryu. They're pretty good. I do remember... Liking DiCaprio's a lot, Dudley's. Poison had a couple of really good ones too. Yang had some great ones. Vipers I liked a lot too. And Jury, yeah. I think I think the three that were like the, the shining pinnacles of cool ass looking ultras, Evil Ryu, Oni, and then Jury. I think those were the three that we ended up giving 10 out of 10s. Cause they're all super good, man. I think Ultra Street Fighter 4 might end up having in the long run some, some better ultras than even SF5.